David, king of Israel. I think we already have a problem. Proverbs, just by their very nature, are things to do. They're ways to be. They are pro verbs or a verb is a action form. It's something that you need to do. And since we know they're the Proverbs of Solomon, we're going to have to look at it from don't do as I do, do as I say. Because you see, Proverbs, in a way of saying don't do as I do, do as I say, isn't one of follow me the way I am, but rather look how stupid I've been, so don't do what I've done. Do you get it? You see, modern Proverbs can reflect the positive side if you turn it around and look at it in the way that God intended for you to. So by way of the Holy Spirit giving us wisdom, we can learn something by people from their past failures as well as their success. So that's why when you hear someone say, don't do as I do, do as I say, that might be a good idea because frankly, they may be a pretty big screw up. <laughs> Kind of like Solomon was, you know, there were some good things he did, but no offense. <laughs> if I'm going to go by an example, I don't think I really um, pick Solomon in all of his wisdom, nor do I pick David in all of his glory. I think I'll just pick, you know, the Proverbs so I could look and see what I should do and maybe avoid the pitfalls of what they had done. So you see, it's not about what you do. It's about what you've done. So before you've done something that you don't want to do, look at Proverbs and learn from them. Take the choices of your decision-making process and ask God to lead you in Proverbs. And I think you'll find that each time that you read a proverb, you'll find some wisdom and knowledge as well as experience in learning not to do what they have done. So in Proverbs today, let's just take that to mind and remember, don't do as I do, do as I say. And that can be a positive thing and not a hypocrisy. So today, when you look at uh, your life and you begin to have children and you begin to realize all the mistakes that you've made in your childhood, don't be surprised you find yourself saying, don't do as I do, but do as I say.